Okay, we're going to look at what a chloroplast is. So a chloroplast is found in a eukaryotic cell or some eukaryotic cells that perform photosynthesis such as plants and multicellular algae. And a chloroplast has a double membrane. Um, so here's our outer membrane. And then on the inside, we have another membrane. So some organelles and cells only have a single layer and this one has two. So here's our inner membrane here. And then this space between them is our intermembrane space. Now within chloroplasts, we have another membrane and this forms these particular structures like stacks. And these stacks can be connected to each other. So they can form like this. So these membranes are called thylakoid membranes. And then the space inside is called the thylakoid space. And these stacks of them together um, are called grana. Okay. Or granum if you've got one. So remember that this is an organelle in particular um, photosynthetic eukaryotic cells. So the outside here is our cytosol. And then we have the two membranes and then the inside of here is called our stroma. And the stroma is where we have particular reactions of photosynthesis carried out. That is our Calvin cycle. Uh, which is also known as the dark reactions of photosynthesis or sometimes we call it the light independent reactions of photosynthesis. And then over here where we have our thylakoid membrane, this is within the membrane where our light reactions of photosynthesis happen within that um, membrane system. Another interesting thing about chloroplasts is that they actually have their own circular DNA. So and we have chloroplast DNA and they also have their own ribosomes. So I'll just represent them in this way. And this means that our chloroplasts carry out some independent activity. So they actually divide independently from the cell by binary fission and they can um, make their own proteins from the chloroplast DNA and using the ribosomes. And as a unit as a whole, they're carrying out photosynthesis with our light reactions occurring in the thylakoid membranes and then the dark reaction or the Kelvin cycle occurring in the stroma. There are about 30 to 40 um, chloroplasts approximately per cell. So 30 to 40 of them. And in plant cells, most of these will be in the um, soft tissue of leaves and we find them in um, all the green parts of a plant. So this is our structure of chloroplasts that are our factories for carrying out photosynthesis in eukaryotic cells.